What's going on guys? I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media bringing you another Dokkan battle video today. So the time is finally here. All seven Namekian Dragon Balls for the third and final set of Pringle Witches have all been released on Global now. And while you should have been collecting your balls every single day, even if you haven't, it's all good because your boy Tiger has got your back. Now, just like I did with the first and second set of Dragon Balls in today's video, I'm going to show you guys all the steps you need to take to complete the third set and make your wishes. Now, why don't we just jump right into it because I don't want to waste anybody's time to collect the first ball. All you have to do is actually complete a Dokkan event. So, for newer players, I just want to show you guys exactly what I mean. Go to Challenge and any of these events right here. Okay, not including Boss Rush, not including Super Battle Road uh, or the Speed Battle, but anything else on the Challenge tab is okay as long as you complete it i believe you can complete stage one stage two you know uh z heart super two doesn't really matter as long as you complete a stage from a dokkan event then you're good to go that's the first ball ball two is the token awaken a card and um just to make a distinction there is a difference between z awakening and dokkan awakening and of course if you are a long time player you already know all of this but for brand new very very brand new players um, I just want to make sure that they are aware what Dokkan Awakening is versus Z Awakening. So for Z Awakening, all you're doing is changing the card from uh, SSR to UR, but they're staying as the same card, right? But Dokkan Awakening is a completely different thing. So let's say this guy, right? I have the, yeah, there you go. We have the medals to awaken him. So this is Dokkan Awakening where you see he changes into a completely different card. So this is a Dokkan Awakening. Just make sure that you're doing a Dokkan Awakening as, a, as opposed to a Z Awakening and you should get your second Dragon Ball. Now, Dragon Ball number three is super simple. Just go to the homepage and click on Pilaf's Trove and you'll get your ball. All you have to do is literally click on the Pilaf's Trove icon, go to the Pilaf's Trove page and you'll collect your third Dragon Ball. Now, ball number four is a little bit more work. You go to event. Um, I believe it's under growth and go all the way down to training at Korn's Tower. So. Just complete any stage within this event. I did uh, stage two Z hard, but I believe anything will work. And once you complete the stage, that's your fourth Dragon Ball. So now we're on number five. And for number five, you just have to go to challenge and complete a, oh, wait, no, never mind. it's growth. <laughs> I lied, it's growth. So you just have to complete a hidden potential event. So right now we have the physical event on, but if, depending on when you're, when you're doing this, um, it could be any other type or it could be all the types if it's the weekend But basically what I'm trying to say is that any hidden potential event will work Just do whichever one's available to you or just choose one if all of them are available and you'll collect your fifth Dragon Ball Now for number six you have to raise the hidden potential of a character And again really really simple go to hidden potential um, I'm gonna use this kid Gohan as an example so you just have to literally open one node. One node, if you want to do more, it's up to you, right? If you were trying to, you know, rainbow a unit or whatever, but if you just want to do one node to collect that Dragon Ball, you're good to go. So you just click activate, activate, click OK, and there is your ball number six. And for the last and final ball, I actually haven't collected it yet because I want to save it for this video, but you have to run an event or a stage. I think any, anything will do. Um, I'm gonna do quest because I want to collect some EXP, but basically you have to run a stage with a mono type team. That means all units of the same type. I'm gonna do here, I'm gonna take my boy Luck and we're gonna do a mono SDR team with SJ4 Goku lead. If you wanna do mono tech or mono AGL, it doesn't matter as long as all the units in that uh, team are the same type, you should be good to go. Well, we took care of business over there. And we're gonna complete the stage. And if all, if everything, you know, goes according to plan, then we should get our Dragon Ball right about now. Now, here we go, there we go. All right, seventh Dragon Ball acquired, here we go, okay. And we, we completed our third and final set of Dragon Balls. So I'm gonna go to home. I'm actually gonna do my summons or my, not my summons, <laughs> my summoning of Purunga on camera. Oh, it gives me the little instruction thing, all right. And uh, we're gonna do this together. But you guys already know pretty much what I wanna pick. I'm gonna go with orbs, Kai's, and... Actually, I don't know, let me, let me take a look at the options again. Oh, goodness, are you who possess the Dragon Ball? State your wish, I will grant any three, all right. Where are my witches? Activate potential. 
Power up super attacks and um, awakening metals. So, no, not support items. It's between training items, awakening items, uh, awakening metals, and gems. I'm gonna go with awakening metals because those are usually a pain in the ass for me. So, I have plenty of training items right now and I have plenty of support items. So, that's not a concern. But we got our prizes. Um, the Perugo event, at least for the third year anniversary, is done until we get more Perugo wishes for... I don't know, I don't know, I don't know if we're gonna get that, like, Tanabata event on Global, because I believe it's a JP, like, festival kind of thing, so... It doesn't make too much sense for us to get it on Global, but, uh, maybe for Christmas, around Christmas time, for that celebration, we will get more Perugo wishes. I'm not really sure, can't promise anything, but anyways, guys, that's how you get all seven Dragon Balls for the third and final set of Perugo wishes. Go and make your wishes, get your orbs, get your kais, and I hope you guys found the video useful. As always, if you like the video, make sure to like the damn video, and if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, you like what you see, then maybe, just maybe, hit that big red subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad now. But as always, hope you guys have a fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media, signing out.